I continue to really struggle to envision the next few years and what it means to creators and creativity. Well, it is so cool to be able to summon these kind of pieces of art or creativity out of thin air, but then you wonder what's lost that the artist learned in the process yeah. of learning how to create that thing, right? Yeah. I got home last night from a trip and my son couldn't stop talking about this thing he was coding in class. Now he's in mm. sixth grade and they were doing this in design class and he's taken like a couple of code camps and he has way more knowledge of coding than I do at this point. But like to listen to him explain it. And like, then this morning he gets up and he's like, can I show you? Can I show you? Can I show you? And he's like, show me these sprites he built for this game. And then this whole thing he coded where these monsters show up. I don't, I don't even understand it, how he did it. But like, that's, that's the joy of creation is like, he learned how to do it. He didn't just give a text prompt and like created the monsters out, created the game. He wouldn't have the same passion for it. He wouldn't have the same fulfillment from it. He wouldn't have the same inspiration to learn how to do more code. And that is why I think about this all the time. It's like, I just, I don't know. Like, I don't know what it means for them in two years, five years, you know, by the time they get out into the professional world, nine years, 10 years, like mm. so weird.